team. Please. There's nothing I can tell you. Mac, come on. He was my big brother. I can't. Something definitely has him scared. Maybe if I could tap into his fear, I could get to the truth. I just need to find something I could use to push him over the edge. Everyone's out to get me. Alex, Ryan, even Riley. Fuck! Even Riley? Did something happen with her? We're done here. Guess they didn't feel like painting the mine. If he's innocent, why is he acting like this? Acting like what? Maybe I can get her to tell me. Hey, Riley. Alex. Hey. That fight Mac had with Gabe over your secret meetings. They were about you applying to college, right? Yeah. Ever since the first time Mac lost his shit in front of him, Gabe and Charlotte had tried to get me to end things with him. And after all this, I can see that they were right. Do you think he's telling the truth about the call? That Gabe never made it? No, I, I, it's not that, I, sorry. I'm really not ready to talk about it. Yeah, I get it. It's just, if he didn't do anything wrong, why is he acting like he has something to hide? He asked me to leave Haven with him. What? Right after the wake. He wouldn't tell me why. But he just looked so guilty. I told him I had to think about it, but... Alex, I... I'm scared he did something horrible. Riley... Thank you for telling me. You deserve the truth. You and Eleanor seem close. She's taken care of me ever since I was little. I never really knew my mom, but she's always been there for me. What does she think about you going away to school? She's thrilled. <laughs> I think she just wants me to end up happy. Will she be all right without you? 
she's a tough cookie, but I do worry about her sometimes. She's getting older. One day I'll have to take care of her. I know having you work with her in the shop has meant the world. Yeah. To both of us. I know you and Gabe were close. How are you doing? I miss him. So much. He was like an older brother to me. I'm glad he had you. Thank you, Alex. Really. I gotta run. There's some stuff I need to do. Okay. We'll talk soon? Yeah. Whenever you want. Mac trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. I bet I could use that to stoke his fear. If I tell him I like him, we'll date, and then we'll break up, and then I'll lose my best friend. I mean, you don't know that. Come on, man. Can't you take a hint? She's not into you. Let it go. Hmm. Maybe I could help them. Wait, hell no. What am I thinking? This is none of my business. Come on, man. Can't you take a hint? She's not- If I tell him I like him, we'll date, and then we'll break up, and then I'll lose my best friend. I should make sure there's nothing else I want to do before I confront Mac. Everyone's out to get me. Alex, Ro What Riley told me might do it but I should make sure there isn't anything I still want to do around town first. Okay, let's do this. I got Riley to tell me about your plans to leave town. That's not something innocent people do. Oh my God, it's not... I didn't do anything. Deal with Mac when I get to him. For now, I need to learn everything I can. Typhon's always watching. They run this whole town. I saw Mac run down that alley. Mac feels like everyone's staring at him. 
Everyone thinks I killed him. They all hate me. It's not fair. I didn't do anything wrong. It should have been you instead. Alex? No! What the hell? There are people out there! No, I told you to call it off! I saw the way they looked at me at the wake. They all think I let him die. I know why you're lying. Typhon's forcing you to deny the call. I know you tried to stop it. They fucked up, not you. Stop lying for them! You don't get it. This wasn't some accident. I told them you were down there, and they detonated anyway. On purpose? Why? I don't know. I swear. And then I get a message telling me to deny there was ever a call. You gotta believe me. Cave and I, we didn't get along, but I, I didn't want him dead. And now, now Typhon's watching me. My girlfriend, she, she thinks I'm a murderer? My neighbors all hate me? I mean, what, what, what the fuck am I supposed to do? I think I can calm him down. But does he deserve it? All right, Mac. Come on. You gotta calm down, okay? Dude, stay with me. I know what it's like to be doubted. To have everyone think the worst of you. But the truth will come out. I'll make sure of it. But Typhon... If Typhon comes after you, they're gonna have to get through me too, okay? <sighs> Thanks. I actually feel a little better. <laughs> yeah, well... You'll learn a thing or two hanging out with shrinks your whole life. <laughs> Haven. I'm gonna get to the truth. Hey. Yeah, it's... Can we talk? Where are you? Okay.
You were right. About Typhon, about Mac. Alex. Mac got the call. How do you know that? He got the call and he lied about it. Doesn't matter. Someone is putting pressure on him to keep quiet. Someone from the mine and... It doesn't matter! I keep coming here and playing it back. But it always ends the same. Ryan. He's dead. He's really dead, Alex. It was my fault. My job is to keep people safe. And I failed. Ryan. I owe you my life. She's wrong. I let her cross that log. I put Gabe in harm's way. I'm not a hero. I'm a coward. Worse than worthless. I know what it's like to feel worthless and helpless. But we saved Ethan. And you saved me. It doesn't matter. Gabe's dead because of me. Gabe, I'm so sorry. I forgive you. How could I not? <laughs> You're not alone. gorilla suit <laughs> does he also jump off of the cliff and into the pool no no he chases a guy in a banana suit that guy jumps off the cliff and into the pool okay i'm i'm sorry this is a mexican restaurant eh, nominally <laughs> <laughs> the food is uh well terrible but it's gabe's favorite place <laughs> i tell you he's the oldest 12 year old i know Ask you something? Of course. You came up here to tell me that I was right about Mac. About him getting the call. How did you know? There's something you should know about me. And it's gonna be easier to show you than to explain it. It's 
This is gonna seem sort of weird at first, then really weird. Do you trust me? Okay. Think of something that just scares the shit out of you. Really focus until you feel it. Mag, Typhon, all of it. You're afraid you won't know how to handle it without Gabe. Never knew anyone so good at getting into and out of trouble. <laughs> oh, man, this one time. Whatever it is you're thinking about, we're going to send him off right this time. About right now? Don't stop, okay? Keep going. Okay. <laughs> what emotion is this? <laughs> together. <laughs> Gabe. <laughs> Goose. I see it. It'll move. <laughs> it's not moving. It'll move. Gabe! That's a lot of blood, huh? Gabe, this is serious. Killing a Canadian goose is a violation of international law. Shut up! It is not. They're Canadian geese, Gabe. The property of the crown. The... the crown of... Property of the crown, Gabe. What do we do? How deep you think? Deeper than that. The Royal Canadian Mounted Police can spot a goose grave at a hundred paces. The Mounties? <laughs> oh, come on, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. How long were you gonna let me dig? <laughs> I wasn't gonna stop you. <laughs> finish burying the goose or not <laughs> okay also property of the crown <laughs> really <laughs> well they are technically protected under the migratory bird treaty act <laughs>
There's something wrong with the way I process other people's emotions. I see these auras, I guess. And sometimes, if somebody's feeling something big, it sort of infects me, and I start feeling it too. And that's what you just did with, with me? <laughs> There's nothing wrong with you. You're a literal wizard. It's, it's only ever been the bad emotions before, but that, that was pure joy. Who else knows? Gabe did. But now I guess just you. And that's how I know Max terrified of Typhon. He reported Gabe's call and they ignored it. Now they're putting pressure on him to toe the line. Okay, but why? I don't know yet. Someone made the decision to let the blast go off. Seems like finding out who would be a good start. So you're going after Typhon? You'll need help. You don't have to. You're stuck with me now. Okay then. Team up. Do the buddy cop thing. <laughs> You're a loose cannon, Chen, but you get results. <laughs> This one's for you, Gabe. I miss you. speak this morning. I couldn't. Hearing everyone talk about him, about the life he had here with all of you. I lost the chance to have that. But even though I only had one day with him, he changed my life. said, I didn't know if I belonged here. He told me that home isn't something you find. It's something you build. Say goodbye. How do I say? 
say, Miss Sarah.